Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously and help me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for War for Cybertron Earthrise Fast Track. And this decal set includes one decal sheet on foil backing. So now, let's take a look at Fast Track both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. In robot mode, straight out of the packaging, Fast Track looks great. This is one of my favorite Earthrise Decepticons. I've always liked Fast Track for some reason. Taking a closer look at the figure, he's got great paint applications there for that red visor. Paint applications there on his antenna. I love the chrome look on that paint. Orange paint applications there on his back and there for windows. He also has great paint right there on the chest with that blue and all the molded details. And really, that's about it for paint applications. I mean, they're minimal but they work and i can't wait to see what toy hacks does for fast tracks robot mode so there we have one final look at fast track in robot mode before and after fast track gets some awesome new details thanks to toy hacks let's go ahead and take a closer look at the figure starting here with the head he gets a new silver decal right there on the crest and a new visor for the eyes I love that. It's a lot more narrow looking and really makes him look a lot more evil. I love the looks of that visor. He also gets chrome decaling right here on top of both shoulders that circle all the way around. There is a new orange stripe right there on each shoulder as well. Moving down here to the chest, he gets new orange decals with some neat hieroglyphics or something there in them. Moving on down here on the forearms, he gets these red and chrome decals. Down here on the belt buckle, he gets a red decal. On the knees, a blue, red, and yellow decal. It looks really good, really breaks that up. I like, I really like that, that is cool. New red decals right there above the feet. And on each side of the feet is an orange decal. So this guy looks awesome now. Oh yeah, there's new blue decals on either side of the orange guns and his little blade that I forgot to show off earlier, I forgot it was actually attached to his back, gets chrome decaling on both sides. So I dig it, Toy Hacks. I love what you did for Fast Track's robot mode. He looks very, very intimidating now. And he also gets a brand new Decepticon logo. And there you have Fast Track in robot mode after. In vehicle mode, straight out of the packaging, Fast Track still looks really good. He's got those great orange wheels and orange guns, and I love the paint applications, especially here on the windows. I love that blue glitter finish. It looks really, really good. He also has orange paint applications right there and there for those little guns. Black paint applications right here on the front of the vehicle and black along the barrels of the guns and right here on the back. All in all, a really cool looking vehicle mode. And there's one final look at Fast Track's vehicle mode before. And after. Fast Track's vehicle mode gets a little bit of help thanks to Toy Hacks. The first decals you're probably noticing are the new orange decals right there on either side of the canopy. You also see the blue decals there on the orange guns, the red and chrome decals right there along the top the yellow decals here on the side, and the chrome there on the end. Moving to the front of the vehicle, he now has headlights and a chrome bumper. And let's see, 
back of the vehicle is the decals from robot mode. So not a bad little addition to Fast Track's vehicle mode. I dig it. I love the extra details. So there's Fast Track in vehicle mode after. Now, for those of you who like to use Fast Track in his spear mode for your Earthrise Scorponok, spear mode gets a few decals as well. You've got the orange decals right there along the tip, orange decals here on either side of these prongs, and of course, there is the dagger once again with those chrome decals. But what I really like is Toy Hacks' surprise mode for Fast Track, spaceship mode. This is really creative, thanks to Toy Hacks. For spaceship mode, you just more or less take the spear and flip it around. You're going to bring this section up right here and then just attach the arms on either side. And you have this really cool looking shuttle. Shuttle mode gets the decals from the vehicle mode cockpit right there, but brand new decals right there and new decals right here in the center. And of course, you got all the decals that carry over from the previous mode. Other new decals include these little silver decals that go behind the legs and some blue decals right here that kind of give the illusion that that is a bridge of the spaceship. And there is new orange decals right there on top. So I really like that. That is a pretty cool utilization of this figure. Now, of course, with spaceship mode, you're going to have this one piece left behind. But Toy Hacks got pretty creative with this as well. Just flip this piece around, flip this section up, and there's decals right there that turn this into a control tower. As you can see, you get two purple decals, control and tower, and these yellow decals right there for lights. So if you got your little Titan Master Scorponok, he can stand right there in the control panel. You can attach this to Scorponok or any other base to do what, you know, whatever you'd like. So you have these two that can now interact with Scorponok just a little bit differently. And I think that is so creative. The Toy Hex decal set for Earthrise Fast Track has got to be one of my favorites so far this year. I really like what these simple little decals have done for this figure. He absolutely pops now, and I really couldn't be happier. They made a great looking figure look 100 times better. Not to mention, the spaceship mode is just ingenious and adds so much more playability to this figure. Now guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. I'm trying my best to get 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. Now before I end the video, don't get mad at me, I forgot to do the before shots on the turntable. I finished shooting his befores and immediately went into decaling the figure. So forgive me, but I will do the 360s for the completed mode. Once again, guys, this is Patriot Prime. Signing out. Hoo-ah!